So, finishing up um, Ed's Acousticaster. What I had to do was <clears throat> um, pull the neck off and I wanted to re-shim it, which is a good thing <laughs> because when I did, this is what I found. Um, it's paper in my rush to finish this thing up freaking back in 19 or uh, 2006 um, we needed a little shim and I used I don't know if you could tell what that is a piece of paper and it's got Curious George on it <laughs> I don't know don't judge <laughs> <coughs> So what I did is I made a 22 thousandths um, teak um, piece to put in there. And the action is about 3.30 seconds. Feels nice. make a small truss rod adjustment because um, I was getting a little fret buzz here which is gone Also wanted me to put uh, a logo sticker on the headstock, so let's get it. so put that on there. Sort of an afterthought. Play pretty nice. Sound pretty good. So it's pretty much all done um, because I had to make a truss rod adjustment. Just gonna let it sit here on the bench for a day or two more and uh, let the neck settle in. And hey, I made it through that without my amp fucking up. <laughs> we also got this. Into 
nice brandy new Fender Lux gig bag. I love these gig bags. Almost every guitar that leaves my shop leaves in one of these. And of course, a few picks. Now, I don't have a complete set of strings, but I do have a, some singles here. And I'm never going to use them, and I had them for a while, so I'm just going to toss them in the big bag. And if, uh, if you can use them, Go ahead. If not, you know, just fucking chuck them. Uh, there. Martin Marquis Acoustics. All right, we got a little bag here. Extra strings. Ed, extra set of knobs in case you don't like the gold ones that are on there. These are the ones that, that I originally had on there, and I just swapped them out because the gold ones look good with the gold hardware. Throw those in. Picks business card and I'm gonna give you one of these it's a toggle switch tip I made these a while back pretty cool little skull call it a macabre knob I don't know throw it on your SG if you want made out of bone threaded for uh, an American switch So, I think I'm going to about do it. Like I said, I'm going to let it sit on the bench for uh, maybe another day or two and let the neck settle in, um, which you're also probably going to have to do once you get it um, because I'm going to loosen up all the strings. And because the guitar has acoustic strings on it, there's a little bit more tension than... Uh, with electric strings so when you get it um, I don't know it's pretty cold I would unpack it and let it sit in a gig bag for a day and then um, tune it to pitch and let it sit another day so the neck can uh, work itself in but anyway that's where we're at <clears throat> so Ed I'll be getting in touch so Behave yourself, and we'll see you next time. Bye.